Good morning. I'm Brother Mark Anderson, pastor of Laurel First United Methodist Church. Jesus once said, if the Son makes you free, then you are free indeed. The other day I witnessed one of the best examples of freedom that I think I've ever seen. It was a nature show about chickens, of all things. These chickens had spent all of their lives in confinement, but now they were being released into an open field. At first they just stood there, but then slowly but surely they began walking around, and when they got beyond a certain point it was like a light switch flipped on. They realized that they were no longer confined to one space, and then things got really interesting. They began running around this direction and that direction, jumping over each other and making all kind of noise. The old rooster would stop every now and then and rear his head back and say, cock-a-doodle-doo. He was happy. And then he would take off again. I have to say it was one of the happiest sights that I've ever seen. It was as if they were saying, free at last, free at last. Thank God Almighty, we're free at last. Now, I know we don't like to be compared to a bunch of chickens, but I think this is a pretty good illustration of what it's like when Christ speaks to our hearts and he says, be free, your sins are forgiven. Go in my name and live. Live like you've never lived before. In one of my favorite hymns, there's this line, today is a day of new beginnings, time to remember and move on time to believe what love is bringing, laying to rest the pain that's gone. My prayer for us is that Christ would increase our faith in his love for us and all that he is doing in our lives and in the world around us. So friends, go in peace today and may the Holy Spirit fill your life with courage and hope for the living of this day. Amen.